little problem in the broadcast, but we can actually make it pop. And okay, so season three of United League Europe 3x3 stage two final. Team Netherlands versus Novi Sad. And Arvin Slachter is the author of the first point of the final game. He gets the first blood and here's uh, Milovakovic for two. Novi Sad uh, looks very determined. JC Ford with a sidestep to go! Boom! Jesse Forn makes Team NL up by one. Already five points in the game. 30 seconds into this final matchup. Milakovic leaving the ball to Dushan Bullard finding the contact. Ross Beckering didn't even try to foul. And now vice versa situation. Beckering gets fouled and he thought that he was fouled in the active shooting. But Regina Polishuk, one of the referees of this final, said that was for foul before the active shooting. Yeah. Simon Avinov is the second referee of this game. Beckering just wants to get away. Amsterdam, I mean, Team NL, they don't want stupid balls. JC Ford for another two. He's on fire. Yeah, he's a great shooter and a great addition for Team NL on uh, this year of United League Europe 3x3. Is that going to be the third two-point attempt? Whoa! Six points for Jesse Ford in the starting 60 seconds. Call the fire department. This guy is completely on fire. Milakovic replies with the two of his own. What is going on in the beginning of this game? JC Ford! 12, 12 points in the starting 80 seconds. Ross Beckering. If he would make that, I would think I would gonna go home. That is an absolutely, absolutely crazy beginning of the final matchup. Milakovic, another point. 13 points in 90 seconds. I just want the ball in uh, JC Ford hands all the time. He was <laughs> close for another attempt. He now takes a breather and uh, Arvin Slocker back into this game. Team NL up 7-6. Slaughter gets screened by Beckering, and that's a tough fall by Milosevic. This is a, you know, your Serbian fall. If you want to fall, just make sure the guy is down. Yeah, that's a cool way to foul, actually. Just make a hard foul. Don't make it an unsportsmanlike foul, but make your opponent knocked down at least. This is Arvin Slachter, Ross Beckering, not the top shooter on the team, but he still makes it. And Team NL up by three already. Two minutes, only two minutes into this game. Milosevic with the drive. I think both teams, they just want to avoid stupid fouls. Kovacevic to Beckering, just made it to Kovacevic. And that's a fancy foul. Speaking of stupid fouls, that was pretty unnecessary. That's foul number one on Team NL. Novi Sad on three fouls. Yeah, Novi Sad is going to continue fouling, no easy buckets, this is the philosophy, they used this method in the first game day in the group stage, probably going to do same here in the final, open two-pointer for Slachter, no good this time. Here's Milakovic and uh, Milosevic has a high advantage over Ford, but that's a great D by Ford, go for two man, go for it, oh my goodness, he just cannot miss. Ford with another steal, go for another two. No, Slaughter. Oh my God, what is Team NL doing? They're just shooting the lights out. They cannot miss from deep. Bullet. I know what they're what they're trying to do. We already have a dunk contest, but they're saying, "Yo, Mr. Foman, we need a we need a two point contest. Also, we want a shooting challenge, and we're gonna win it." Jesse Ford, absolutely crazy this game. Uh, he already had four two-pointers. He scored four of those. This is fall number five uh, of four on Team Novi Sad and uh, Team NL. They have a chance to make it a six-point game if Max Kovacevic scores this one. Oh my god. Uh, I just cannot believe what's going on. But I mean, Novi Sad, they still have time to get back here. Be lucky with great drive and make it with another foul that's one. No, that's just one free throw coming up. We have our first TV timeout. Yeah, we need to breathe. Not only the players, guys. I, I bet you also need a, a pause in this game.
Yeah, crazy matchup here in St. Petersburg. Radoga Mall means rainbow in Russian. Team NL up by six in the final, 14-8. Okay, here we go with a free throw attempt from Marko Milakovic, the youngest guy on the squad, very experienced Novi Sad team. And he misses the free throw attempt, so it's Max Kavacevic driving inside, finding the contact, and that one being a crazy bucket if he made it. Good D by Milakovic, here's the king, Dusan Bullard, we haven't seen enough of him in this game. Milakovic, straightaway jumper is good. And it's a five-point game. Beckerin inside and one! That's foul number five for Novi Sad. What's that? That's another foul before the active shooting and Ross Beckerin furious again because he already had a similar moment like that in this game already. He had a small talk with Regina Polishuk. Now, once again, it's a foul before the active shooting. Maybe saves Novi Sad from two extra points of Team NL and finally, Dushan Bullet with a two-point attempt. Jesse Ford obviously wants to find another two-point attempt for himself. This is slacked there. Open for Ford. Two-pointer. Oh, that would have been too much if he made it. That would have been something from out of space, you know. That's the first piece of uh, the game for Ford. And uh, Novi San just three points down. Milosevic, that's foul number three on Team NL. And uh, they're up 14 to 11, six minutes to go in this game. This is uh, so high scoring. They look like they are in a rush to get somewhere, you know. Nightlife in St. Petersburg are waiting for them. But first, they need to get over with this final. Another foul on Team NL. You know, actually, if Team uh, Netherlands win this game, you're going to have the post-game interview and you can ask some of them was that the tactic was that the game plan you know to outscore Novi Sad in the starting minutes and uh, I think their plan works so far it's an That's offensive foul offensive foul foul number five uh, just a three point game still all to play for here it's not over obviously Max Kavacevic finds the pass to Slachter he plays against Bullet Three in the key, no good, and Dugi with the rebound. Can Milakovic score on this attack? No, he goes for a pass to Bullet. Dushan over Kavacevic. Step back and two points just short. Great D by Max Kavacevic, the OG, all against her, and uh, he's up against the Russia. He loses the handle, and that's a ball to Novi Sad. Yeah, this is going to be Novi Sad possession. Max Kovacevic frustrated by the refereeing. Probably he was shouting out foul on this collision with Dushan Bullet. Obviously, Bullet and Kovacevic know each other pretty well and they know the weak and strong sides of each other. Regina Polishuk and Simon Avinov are talking about the fresh 12 second attack on Novi Sad. Dushan with the ball, open bucket for Milakovic. Easy, but great work from Strahinia Milosevic. Marko Milakovic, that's another offensive foul this time from Team NL, foul number five. But Marko Milakovic is having the best game offensively for Novi Sad ever. I mean, he's only played uh, a few of those. Milakovic with the two, he cannot get it. He only gets the rim, and uh, who's got the ball? It's still Novi Sad with the ball, I think, right? Yeah, it was Ross Beckering who touched the ball last, and they're going to have a few more seconds to attack. No, they have 12 because Ross Beckering played with his leg. Dushan, easy bucket. It's not easy, but he just makes it look so easy. It's a one-point game. It's a huge comeback by Novi Sad. JC Ford this time with the drive. Turnover, bullet for two. Novi Sad was close to get that lead, but they're still with possession. Milosevic. It's a foul down low. That's foul number six on Team NL. Smart foul by Max Kovacevic. He knew that Milosevic is going to fall inside and try and score from inside the bucket. So he fouled during his first step to the buck. Milakovic. He finds contact, but great defense by Slachter, and he goes out of bounds, so it's Team Netherlands with the possession. 
Manel haven't scored for a while. I think it's been uh, two minutes maybe without them scoring. JC Ford back into the game. Slaughter with a drive. Ford, Mekarin inside, but what a block! Dugosha says net. And Milosevic with a one-hander. It's 14 0 Novi Sad tied the game, and that's uh, foul number six on Novi Sad. Both teams on six fouls with 4.30 to go in this crazy final. Yeah, absolutely. Great game. Uh, team Netherlands scoring loads of buckets in the beginning of this final, but Novi Sad coming back and playing even better defense right now. So and they look as the favorites in the ending minutes but it's a bucket for team Netherlands Beckering inside 15 for team NL huge attention to Ford on the line so uh, he just passes the ball meanwhile Milosevic ties it again 15 all locked up to Beckerin another bucket from the tall guy from the team NL yeah now they're gonna give these easy buckets because they cannot foul too many attempts from Milakovic, he cannot buy them from distance. Slachter. Whoa, this is a foul on Ross Beckering on the floor. So this is team foul number seven for Team NL. Unfortunately for the Dutch squad, this is going to be two free throws, but only after the timeout. And actually, the foul is on Novi Sad. I'm sorry for the uh, wrong information. Foul on Novi Sad, so we're going to see Team NL on the free throw stripe. It's funny that uh, Rose Becker thought the ball was on him, <laughs> and it took a while for Max Kovacevic to actually explain, man, you were shooting. Not, uh, not back in and shooting those free throws, but Team NL shooting those free throws. Yeah, I, I also thought that it's a foul on Novi Sad, but then the reaction of Ross Beckering made me think the opposite way. And uh, actually, now Team NL has a great chance to get the lead even more comfortable. 17 to 15, both teams in the bonus, and we're under four minutes. I'm pretty sure this game is going to finish in the next minute or maybe one and a half maximum because both teams are on fire, and Team NL are up by three right now. What a steal! Slachter, great interception, and here's Max Kovacevic with a bucket. Uh, it's a four-point lead, Team NL. Are they going to do it again? Man, this is crazy week for these two guys, the twins, Arvin Slachter and Max Kovacevic. They're on the verge of winning another big event. Dushan, Dushan, no dribble, pass inside, and this is a mistake for Novi Sad. They lose the ball, and Team NL can win it all already in this first attack. Do you believe in that, guys? Maybe. They are gonna win already in a few seconds. Jesse Forn, will he go for the win? No, it's Slachter. No, it's Forn. Jesse, nah, they're going for the 20. No chance for the distance shot. It's still a match point for Netherlands and uh, Max Kamachi, which win the ball. They're up by four, three minutes to go, but it doesn't really matter. 80 bucket gives. Here. Yeah, that was a clean play by Novi Sad. A very, very important steal. Dushan with a 17th bucket of Novi Sad. Can they win it all in this attack? Novi Sad playing phenomenal defense. Jesse Forn, two seconds on the shot clock. Yes! Woohoo! Jesse Forn, congratulations to Team Netherlands. An absolutely great week for the Dutch side. They have just won the Doha Masters, the first of this year, FIBA 3x3 in Doha, Qatar. And now they're winning it all here in United League Europe 3x3 Stage 2. What a marvelous game from the Dutch team. Jesse Forn, Max Kovacevic, Arvin Slachter and Ross Beckering are the champions of the second stage of Ule 3x3. 